The Women in Science Luncheon is my favorite day of the year at Rockefeller. It's a day when the campus looks its best. Hundreds of women turn out in their finery and they're willing to spend a couple of hours uh, listening to and interacting with women scientists. It's a huge amount of fun for us. The Women in Science Luncheon is the highlight of the year, I think. Rockefeller has an extraordinary array of women scientists. Women in Science is really critical because, as you know, women have been underrepresented in science everywhere. The Women in Science program at Rockefeller has actually um, become a blueprint for other institutions nationwide, possibly even globally at this point, to do initiatives similar to the one that we have. It really is amazing. It's an event that really brings women of the city together, women working for women to do great things for all mankind. I feel women are really interested in learning about my biomedical sciences. They want to know exactly how things work, how cells work, what the causes of disease are, how treatments work. This institution is unusual in its high standard and it's also unusual in that it allows people to just do research. The way that this program reaches out to college students and to younger people and young scientists, and they are, they become mentors and they um, become role models and that it's possible for women to succeed in science and they're in front of us here and that's a privilege to see. I have to emphasize how important it is to have a scientific lecture attended by more than 500 women given by a woman. That is a real benchmark occasion in, in science and I, the, the level of the intellect, the level of questions, uh, it was just, it was very, very impressive and it's very encouraging for those of us who really support women in science. What makes this luncheon unique of all the many luncheons that take place in New York is I think it's this great opportunity for two cultures to meet. And the way that the tables are set up, every table has a scientist, either a faculty member or a student or a postdoc, and it's mutually beneficial. So we get to talk about our science, which I think interests the women who are guests, but also we scientists get to interact with these incredible women, successful in, in business, in finance, in the arts, and in philanthropy, and we would never get to meet them otherwise. I love going to the Women in Science luncheons because it's a really great chance to meet women from New York who do all kinds of different things and they can kind of look at the broad picture and ask really interesting and challenging questions that are different than the ones a scientist might ask. I always learn something at the Women in Science luncheon. It really allows us an opportunity to broaden our horizons as well as the Women in Science organization to broaden their horizons. So it's just a wonderful um, blend. Uh, the current Women in Science Fellows, please stand and be recognized. And it's a pleasure to welcome all of you to our 15th annual Women in Science Lecture and Luncheon. Uh, happy birthday to Women in Science. Happy 15th anniversary to the Women in Science Initiative at Rockefeller. Happy 15th anniversary, Women in Science. Happy 15th anniversary. Happy 15th anniversary. 15 years, it's amazing. It's going to keep on going. We're so proud of all the women and some men who helped to make this such a great success. Thanks so much.